Hello guys, I'm Grouseller and today I have another opening of the Pokemon set 151 of Scarlet and Violet. Today I will be opening the binder collection that it doesn't even fit on this camera, right? My setup still needs a little bit of work to be done. But if you want to see it better here, like you have a giant binder of Mew, which is amazing with the artwork of all the 151 Pokemon. And then you have four boosters. So let's crack open this box, right? And uh, let's see if we can get something cool out of the boosters. Because normally these boxes, in other sets, they don't have good pull ratios. But for these, I think these are the best products to open, right? If you want some extra pulls and some cool stuff. Because the pull ratios are really good. Like, at least way better than the uh, booster bundles. Okay, so let's take a look at this. Yo, this has a really decent finish. It looks quite good. It has like these two to close it. Okay, so let's take a look inside. Okay, so yeah, this this looks really nice. Like it's probably not the most expensive and most quality binder out there in the market, right? But it's smooth, it's nice. Like if you want a binder to like put the set right the entire the, a master set of 151 this is probably your choice because it's so cool right it's kind of nice so if you want to see it up close here in this camera guys it looks amazing okay here which is better lightning but yeah this this looks nice like i'm liking this binder a lot <laughs> to be honest okay i'm gonna put it to the side and let's go for the boosters and let's see we have four boosters like we can get like nothing at all or we can get crazy stuff like this set is kind of like all over the place right you can get like six special artworks i believe that's in the set there's three gold cards like more or less in online on which they have been doing the set right these sets recently with uh, Scarlet and Violet. Alright, let's open the packs. Let's see what we get. Alright, you can get some really sick pulls. Like, there's the illustration rares and special artworks of the starters, which I would love to collect. But it's gonna be tough. It's gonna be tough getting those, and they're gonna be expensive if you buy them separately. But yeah, let's see. Okay, we have Pikachu, Farfetch, Shelder. Helix Fossil, Cider, Charmeleon, Parasect, Dugon Rebus, Victory Bell Rebus. Yo! Okay, new EX full art. That's what I'm talking about. This is another sick catapult. And the first booster, too. Like, yo! This is so nice. Yo, look at that car. That car's beautiful. Again, then the basic energy. And then a code card for you guys. But yeah, really happy with this pool already. Like as I've been saying, I, I think like collection boxes are the best product to open. If you want at the very least one pool, it's probably you have a really high chance of getting something right. Because other products come like really dry on pools. I, I don't know why I've been seeing so many openings, right? But the collection boxes and the ETBs, especially. I feel like they have the best pull ratios out of any product, right? Like the mini booster bundles, they have six boosters, but I've seen a lot of them having nothing or only one hit, and that can be an EX, a normal EX. Sometimes you have two, but I've been seeing a lot of them being opened and it's pretty rare, so I would say these ones are better. Okay, Bellsprout, Horsey. Nidoran, Abra, Erika's Invitation, yeah, the special rare of this would be amazing to pull, Magneton, Nidoqueen, Raihon Reverse, Ghastly Reverse, this really weird Ghastly, then we have Raichu, Hollow, Normal Energy, and a cold card for you guys. So that was a normal booster without anything, we still have two more. I mean, I'm already pretty happy with that new EX full art, but I think we can pull something else in these two packs. Like, I don't know, a normal EX, Illustration Rare, or even a Hollow Energy. I'm happy with any of those. 
so let's go. Okay, we have Slowpoke there, chilling in the water. We have Magma, Horsey, Abra, Cloyster, Giovanni's Charisma, Rhydon, Raticate Reverse, Sidra Reverse, and then Mr. Mime, Normal Hollow, and a special energy. Like Grass Energy it has like two swirls, swirls, I think I see. Yeah, those are pretty nice and a different energy too that I don't have. And a code card for you guys. I think I have like three or four different special energies already. I want all of them. <laughs> like, they're so cool looking like an entire page, right, of your binder with those. Look really sick. Okay, so last booster of this box. Let's see if we can get something out of the last pack, right? That, that would be amazing. Alright, let's go, let's go. Okay, we start with Old Amber, Pidgeotto, Magmar, Shelter, Rapidash, Nidorina, Raticate, Geodude, Rebus, Dratini, Rebus, ah, Flareon, Hollow. That's gonna be our last pull from this opening and a cool card for you guys. I am quite happy with that Mew full art and reverse energy or hollow energy, however you want to call it. Like a really pretty decent box overall, I would say. But yeah, pretty happy with the pull rates of this one. Okay, guys, that was everything. Thank you for watching. Click one of the videos that you're going to be seeing here. Give the video a like if you like the content. Remember to subscribe to the channel to give my channel a little bit of help to be reaching those sub numbers. Let's see if we can reach partner soon, which is going to be a thousand subscribers. It's still far ahead, but hey, if we can reach that goal, I will be really happy to have reached that. That's been my goal for quite some time, and it would be nice to reach that.